Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. You'll never have the sacred stone. <laughs> oh, this you crazy mother. Hi guys, thanks for joining me tonight. It's gonna to be a bit of a struggle tonight, I think. <laughs> this grass, massively long. It's quite thick and all this grass. It's not like light meadow grass. It's like, I don't know, thick grass. I've got two challenges though tonight. One is to find something within this very, very exceedingly long grass. The second thing is, like, when I last came in here, I, uh, I looked under one of the hedges and there's like an old antique bottle just sitting under the hedge. I couldn't, get it because it was in the, the, the field with all the cows so if we can get in that field tonight without getting attacked by any moo cows i'm gonna see if i can't get hold of that ball so have a bit of a look at it see how old it is hey eh? so thanks for looking in and uh when i find something i'll whack it on the uh, on the video let's uh, do this and let's crack on so here it is behind this or underneath this edge here so all I've got to do is scale this gate that I'm going to take you over in a minute and I'll have a quick look under that edge I know it's under there because you've seen it I don't know how old it is but hey let's give it a go let's give it a go I'm now we're going to attempt to do this whilst filming <laughs> if I fall oh, over this gate subscribe <laughs> I've done it for you No cows because they can hear me. Oh. You see any? I can't. It is. I hope we can reach it from this side actually. No, I can't see it from this side. Some Doritos if you want. Where has that bottle gone? I'll just turn you off for a sec till I can locate it. Hi guys, hard breath getting that. Oh, I've been scratched all up trying to reach in the edge, forget that. It's, just, it's not an oldest one, but it's the strangest one. Can you read that? Half wine glass, one wine glass. So to you drinkers out there, you might be able to help me. Take it, half this bottle is half the wine glass, and the full bottle is a full wine glass, would you say? Never seen a bottle like that before. But like a wine glass measure. Screw top, so it's not massively old. Yeah, that's a great bottle. I'm gonna take this home, clean it up. An awesome little bottle. One wine glass, half a wine glass. Are you an half? Are you a full? <laughs> Most people I know, they're a full, not half. So let's crack on. Let's do this, let's see if we can get some detected done. Hi guys, yes, I'm back. Look at this grass. It's not there no more. He's gone. <laughs> Brilliant. First signal of tonight. What do you think? A digger? I'll take the digger. It's got to be worth a try. Let's see what's down there. Hi guys, there it is. Can you see it sticking out the side? What's that? A roundy shape. Let's have a look at you. I'll be that. What's that? That's a strange one. So it's no, it's not top of a spoon, is it? Is it? It's got a wee little hole in it there. Who knows? The first find is an oddment. Let's crack on. See what else we can get. 
chew, cow chew, cow chew, cow chew, cow chew, cow chew. No more. Don't want any more of them. See, you can't really... You can't dig it. It's cow chew. Let's crack on. Let's crack past these things. What do you make of this, guys? I'm not going to say it's possible. So it looks silverish because it's got that black patina on it. Or it could just be. It doesn't feel like. It feels a bit too heavy for Ali. Could that be a possible chunked up piece of silver? Beautiful signal. I hope it is. Could do with some. Look at that. There you go. Maybe a possible chunked up piece of silver, but I'm not saying it is. I don't like doing this bit and rub test because it makes me gag. So I'm either going to say it is, or I'm going to say it isn't, based on what you say in the bottom. I'm going to say it's a maybe. Let's crack it on. Let's get to those next finds. Hi guys. Just got out of there, I just made a bit of food. I just about to get me, me, me phone out and say, oh, oh, I found my first coin. That fell out. See it? And then on closer inspection, I thought, I ain't no coin. That's a big button. Bloody big button as well. Nice one. Could be a pattern on that. I'm going to say that's 1700s. It's a really old button. And it's still got the shank. So, I'm sorry, I'm not a guy. I thought it was, I thought, well, everybody else first coin. Never mind. Let's crack on. See what else we can get. Hi, guys. Well, I'm pretty sure this is a coin now. Come out of there, look. Oh, lovely. There she blows. That cannot be a button. Please don't be a button. Don't be a button. Don't, just don't be a button. Don't have a shank. Oh, the impression. Oh yeah, that's a coin. You can always tell a coin. It's a, um, yeah. That is a Georgie third. I can't really get much detail, but it's definitely a George Third. Can you just tell by the feel and the bloody boldness? <laughs> it's a Borgie! So that's going to be 1700s, 1800s, 1806 maybe. I don't even think if I cleaned it up I'd get much more detail off it. I thought it was a silver one at first when it flopped out, but... It wasn't a... Oh, it wasn't a great signal either when it was in the ground, but... I dug it anyway. Let's crack on. Let's get some more of these bad boys. Hi guys, gonna call it a night for tonight. It's starting to go dull. I don't, it, I don't think it's gonna start raining again. It's been raining here all day, but it's been lovely tonight. So, gonna come back in here tomorrow night. This grass is lovely. What he will do soon is start putting poo on here. I wanna try and get in before he puts I'll still come in when there's poo on it, but I wanna try and get in before he gets to poo on it. So, I'll come out tomorrow night. Finds have been a bit slim tonight simply because it is a new permission again. So, it's finding those patches at the top, the bottom, middle, where, you know, I've had some good finds, but I wouldn't say spectacular finds. So as per normal, if you could uh, subscribe at the bottom, you're going to want to for that thousand giveaway. I'm going to give you a bit of a clue. There's going to be a silver bar in it. I've decided to put a silver bar in it. The link to me winning this silver bar will be at the top. Okay, be at the top. So if you want to see this silver bar, the link to that video will be at the top, I decided to give it away myself. Now, the way I'm going to draw this, this video is when I get to a thousand, I'm going to do a random.org of the last ten videos before I get to the thousand. So, one to ten, a random.org, that'll give me the video. And once I've got the video number, I'm going to go to that video and just simply do a random comment picker. A random comment picker. And that comment is going to win the prize. This is going to be a silver bar, silver coins, a finds box, loads of stuff, loads of stuff. Okay. So all you've got to do to be in that is just simply uh, subscribe and comment. That's all you've got to do. That's all you've got to do. You, you can comment on one video and that'll be the video that, that it picks. You can comment on all. The reason I'm doing it that way is because the people who regularly comment and watch the videos and support the channel get just as big a chance as somebody who suddenly just come in to try and win something and then I'll probably go again. Okay, so that's why I'm doing it. 
So best of luck if you want to have a go at that. I'm, I'll do a video with showing you the prizes, but at the moment, because I'm, I'm still quite a ways off yet, so I don't want to show you too much. But if you want to have a look at the silver bar like again, click that video, the video link at the top, and you can see it. So all I have to say is, let's crack on to the next hunt, and let's dig, shall we? Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. You'll never have the sacred stone. <laughs> oh, this you crazy mother. <laughs>